Meteorologist Haley Clausen. It was an active radar this afternoon across the high desert as well as our mountains with monsoonal thunderstorms firing up. Although today was actually drier than what we felt yesterday. Seems a little counterintuitive there, but Yes, look at our dew point temperatures, primarily in the 50s across the Coachella Valley, where yesterday we were in the 60s across the Coachella Valley. A little bit drier, that allowed us to warm up just by a little bit. At this hour, plenty of blue sky is back with us as those clouds are clearing, and Palm Springs was able to reach a high temperature of 110 degrees this afternoon, thermal coming in at 111. But those morning lows, not all that low. You want to get even warmer? That's what we're doing tomorrow. Tomorrow looking to be the warmest day of the week. For the rest of this evening, we are still going to be seeing some passing clouds as we head through the evening hours. Humidity, not ideal, about 25%, but still, again, better than what we were experiencing yesterday. And temperatures on their way trending down below the century mark by the 9 p.m. hour. We're still under the influence of this ridge of high pressure along with the rest of the western United States. So we're still going to be dealing with more heat tomorrow. We're still dealing with that southeasterly flow, and that's what's providing those monsoonal thunderstorms. We have the heat, we have the moisture. All it takes is a bit of instability, and those thunderstorms fire up in the afternoon. That's exactly what was happening out there today. Get ready for more of the same as we head into tomorrow. So let's go ahead and break down our future cast. Moving into tomorrow afternoon, we'll begin to see an increase in cloud cover, opportunity for showers and storms to develop over the high desert and our local mountains once again. However, it's as we head through the night into Friday that we're really looking to see that push of uh, monsoonal moisture, that next surge flow into southeastern California. And that's when it's going to be bringing a better opportunity for rain right here on the valley floor as we head throughout the day on Friday with storms and showers working their way across the desert. Now, yes, mostly cloudy skies are going to be with us for Friday, and we're still even looking at partly cloudy skies as we head into our Saturday. All in all, the rainfall estimates are changing drastically because, well, it really all depends as to where those thunderstorms truly develop. Where those storms do develop, we could see rainfall amounts near a quarter of an inch again. However, if it's not a thunderstorm and it's just a passing shower, then we're looking at under a tenth of an inch. But yes, rain is in the forecast as we head from Friday into our Saturday on your Comfort Air 7 day forecast. If you want it warmer and drier, here we go. Next week, that's calling our name. But for Friday, Saturday, note those temperatures taking a dip with the increase in cloud cover. More of that sunshine returns again early next week. John Karen. A drier going? 110 might not be a terrible thing. Oh, no. Not too bad. Yeah, no. Exactly. Feel better than today did. Yes. <laughs> Thank, Thank you, Haley. Coming up, all new on News.